Hello and welcome. Today we'll be explaining the Westerland co-integration test using the xt coint command. The Westerland co-integration test using the xt coint test command. And as I have revealed before, to estimate a co-integration test, we have to make sure that all our variables are i1 stationary. So we are going to be making the assumption that our variables in this model are i1 stationary. As I said, the command is the xt coint coint test xt coint test and so we include westerland and then we place our dependent variable so for this uh, for this video i am going to be testing for co-integration uh, using the log of co2 emissions the log of gdp uh, renewable energy the log of population and fdi and I click enter. Now we could see that the null hypothesis for this test is no co-integration, while the alternate hypothesis is that some panels are co-integrated. And you could see from our various variance ratio statistics probability value indicating that we reject the null hypothesis and accept the alternate hypothesis that some panels are co are co-integrated. So as you can see, the null the alternate hypothesis here is some panels are co-integrated. We can hence estimate or examine if all panels are co-integrated using the command all panels. We click enter. The results are quite similar. The probability value is less than conventional level of statistical significance, indicating that there is co-integration for all panels in the model.